Hi, I'm Kenneth Wajda. I'm a professional photographer here in Colorado. Welcome to another one of my photography talks. Actually, this may be the last of my photo talks for a little while. Because I, I feel like I've gotten to the point where I'm at the end of what I can really talk about. I've talked about lots of pictures. I've talked about lots of books. I've talked about lots of gear. And I love to shoot. I love to travel and take photographs wherever I go. And I always have a camera in my hand. But at the same time, I've been doing this show. I've been really inspired to continue to build it and create it. But then YouTube pulled out any kind of monetary uh, recovery from any of the work that I'm doing. And then I'm getting to the point where I feel like there's no more energy. We're slowly building 3,000 hits or 3,000 subscribers. But, you know, they want me to have 4,000 watch hours. And most of my videos are probably... 2800. I don't even know what that means exactly. I think people make longer videos so that their watch hours go up. And most of my videos are kind of short because I'm big on trying to tell one little nugget of information and get to the point or show a camera and, you know, get out. Who's got 10 minutes to watch a video every time you make a video? But I'm betting that's why some of those folks are making videos that are longer like that. But it never was for the money, but certainly the money was motivation for continuing and, and looking for new ideas of what else I can talk about. And it was a little bit of a reward, but, but with that gone and the Patreon, I have a handful of supporters and I appreciate all of you, but it really doesn't seem like I'm finding that much inspiration myself to find more things to talk about. It gets to the point where it's like, well, maybe I should take a little break. And maybe I can come back and I'll have more things to talk about because the element of time will have created new opportunities for stories. So I have about three more episodes after this one that I'll run that I purposely made so I wouldn't have this one be the last one. But at the same time, going forward, I'd like to maybe look for other ideas for some other shows I can do, some other kinds of talks that maybe would build a larger audience and you guys have all been great but certainly according to YouTube it's just not sustainable and I don't know that I agree with them but at the same time making YouTube videos is time consuming and it's one of those things that the people who, who are making them and making a living off of them it's something that's growing and for me it's really not and I love film photography. It's probably, I have the smallest niche of photographers, the guys who are doing the gear reviews. Those guys know that's what makes the numbers. And then they probably do 10 and 15 minutes on each one. And it's funny, when I started this, I remember talking about inspiration and talking about, you know, putting your heart into what you're doing. And it's all about, you can do it. Anybody can do it. There's no barrier to who can create and who can succeed as a photographer. Everybody makes mistakes. Even pros make, make mistakes. The goal is to just keep going and believing in yourself. And I believe that. And people would say, oh, I love the fact that your talks are short and they don't just talk about gear. And at the same time, when I did talk about gear, those numbers were always slightly larger or significantly larger than the inspiring talks or the book talks, which is just a fascinating thing. I think people in our business are so attracted to gear, and I am certainly too. But... There comes a time when it's like maybe talked about all I can think of to talk about. And I love answering your questions. I try to get to all the questions that come into the comments and I try to answer every one. So if you have any more, please do put them in there. And then if you have any ideas for maybe future shows I could do or other ideas of things that would be of interest to you. I feel like I've covered almost every camera out there and I feel like I've dealt with a lot of different kinds of photography and I've shown lots of pictures. So there's a point where I feel like maybe I'm, I'm at a, an end, a, 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 at least a stepping off point or a pause. And so there'll be a handful more, maybe three, maybe four more episodes. And then I'll still be around. I'll be watching the comments and I'll answer questions. And I'd love to be able to stay connected. And I'd hope that someday be able to bring more videos or else maybe uh, change the topic a little bit or come up with new ideas for what else could work that would be of interest. My ultimate goal has always been to inspire photographers and to get everybody to realize that, you know, we all have what it takes to create our vision and the world needs our vision, needs your vision. 
And that's what I've tried to do with these talks, and hopefully I've done some of that. All right, that's today's photography talk. Thanks so much for watching.